I would love to dig a bit deeper into vulnerability detection. How can it help MSPs, organizations cut through the noise, eliminate false positives, and improve the signal to noise ratio for security teams? So again, this is just go back. It's better better to restate what happens in in general application of vulnerability technology, right? So the scanning products they they look and scan for everything. So um, you might get millions of pieces of information, a bit like you get from security scanning products on routers or firewalls and things. It's a lot of noise. So that's why all of that that um, information typically goes into an analytics platform, whether it's you know QRadar or Splunk or something like that as a SIM. And that's and that's what security products do. They sift through that. You're trying to look for different security insights. The challenge with a lot of application vulnerabilities, you don't know what is actually being used or not. You don't know um, how vulnerable a piece of code is or not. You don't know what the patching strategy or anything in terms of the DevOps cycle around that piece of, of code. Nothing that you're collecting is, is really giving you um, direction as to where you need to go looking. Now, there's two types of uh, aspects to this. The first one is posture. So that's more like proactive analysis. So where Intelligence Cloud helps is that you can identify very quickly where you have not patched for security issue. So that a very good example would be, you know, there are many people that still have log4j sitting in their environment. They just don't know where it is. And, and the scanning products aren't finding it, right? So we can find that almost instantly with Intelligence Cloud. Um, but also on the flip side of, of, of maintaining much better posture is, is what you do with an incident, right? If you have a breach and you know that was caused by some uh, network vulnerability that uh, ultimately led to an application vulnerability, you don't necessarily know where that is unless you can triage. And again, this is another aspect of, of the intelligence that we provide. We're not necessarily doing the job of um, incident uh, reporting technology or incident management technology from security. But what we are doing is providing the intelligence. So you can either use the tool sets that we have, or you can integrate that data into those types of architectures and then navigate very quickly to, to what you need to go remediate. 